on this path about really defining what our purpose is. And, and what I'm challenging you on now is how definite, how definite can you be on that purpose that you've got for you? So before the last time uh, I shared something with you, we looked at the power of a definite purpose. What I want to do now is really start working through how you and I can put our definite purpose to words. How can we begin to picture it? How do we develop the kind of clarity that we really need? So if you really dig into what I'm sharing here, if you read the, the attachments or you work through some of the different stuff we've got, you'll see I share some stories around. A friend of mine called me recently after he read in just 24 hours, he read the entire What's Killing Your Profitability book. And we've worked together for years and years and years. And, and it was just so neat to see how excited he got over reading it. And at the end of the conversation, he says, gosh, you're going to impact people, thousands of people with this book that you'll never get to meet. And, and that is exactly why I wanted to do the book. And that's, that's what we get out of bed for in the mornings. And that was really the words around that purpose that we feel. That's what drives us. Now, I also share a story about how if we didn't have that clear purpose, we probably wouldn't have made it through the second part of 2020 in business for ourselves and, and definitely not into 2021 because the world changed. We had a, a good start to the year 2020 and, and, and then things changed, right? You can ex um, go back to that date without getting some PTSD, hopefully, but you can, you can to know what you experienced in that time. And that was the first time that Cindy and I, neither one had full-time employment or any W-2 employment for that matter. And the world changed. And, and, and if we couldn't really, really articulate that purpose that we were working to achieve and why we took the risks we did and why we were doing the work that we chose to do, we might not have been able to handle, we probably would have said, hey, is there anybody hiring? Can we go do HR? Can we go do sales? Can we do whatever we've done in our careers to that point to, to just get a paycheck? Now, what I want to challenge you to do is I share some of those stories, I can give you my purpose. I can give you that, that clarity that I've got for me. I want to challenge you to think about it for you. And if you dig into what I'm sharing here, you'll, you'll see an example of how I explain specifically what I ate for breakfast the morning that I put all this together and, and how much detail I could share, painful detail if you want to get into it, but how it really was something that I could see. And that's how clear we need to see what we're working to achieve, what goals do we have, what purpose, what definite purpose are we working toward? Now, if you'll bear with me, if you'll dig into this and really work through it with me, we're going to move forward next to figure out, hey, there's no, no such thing as something for nothing. What do we need to do to achieve that purpose? What do we need to be prepared to give if we really want to get? Now, before we get there, I'll challenge you if you've never done it before. I think there's some links to the book, What's Killing Your Profitability? And it's just had tremendous success on Amazon early on. And it, we've had a lot of fun with that and so on. But there's also a short assessment wherever you're accessing this, probably at the bottom of the page or whatever, where I'm going to walk you through in a video a couple different questions that helps identify what's killing the profitability in your business right now and how can we give you a tool be it a complimentary resource, a digital resource that's low cost, a one-on-one -on -one conversation to figure out what's best for you. How can we support you in capturing that profitability that's that's undoubtedly being lost in your business right now? And how can we help you through it? So hope this serves you in some way. Look forward to catching back up again soon. So we talk when we talk about what you got to give to be able to get and really dive into more on that definite purpose. Make it a great day. Look forward to ch chatting with you soon. God bless.